Hello everyone, Denise here. Today I am opening up some Premier Yarns and uh, doing a comparison. I haven't picked up uh, the Loops and Threads yarn yet, but I couldn't wait because I really want to see this yarn. So I'm going to open this up and take a first look at it. Okay, what do we have here? We have Premier Canyon Colors. This is 109 yards, 100 meters, 3.5 ounces, 100 grams, 100% acrylic. Feels very nice. This color is Storm Cloud. It is tested and approved against 350 plus harmful substances and it's bulky weight five. This is the same specs on the yarn and it is retro sunset. These colors look different online than they do when you hold them, which is not surprising, but this one, I feel like it seemed brighter uh, online when I would see it. Pull my lights down here. When I would see it online, it looked brighter to me but uh, it also depends on what device you're using and the settings and yada, yada, yada. So it feels really nice, very soft, of course. And you know, I never have a complaint about Premier Yarns. Uh, I bought this to compare to Loops and Threads uh, Charisma, which when I had purchased my Charisma and I did my spiffy cabled hat and cowl out of that, I don't see it around me, but I made a hat and a cowl and I thought it was very, very similar to this yarn and or Serenity. I believe this is Strawberry Multi is the colorway in this. And it's really hard because it's already made up. So I'm going to have to wait to get my Michaels order until later. But uh, that this is going to be the comparison between these two yarns. Uh, I thought the colorways of the Canyon colors were very similar to some of the Charisma, almost identical. So uh, while that may not be true, it might not be identical. Identical. I thought if I compared them, maybe if you have some Charisma, you can't get any more or you don't want to get any more and you want to match it with another color, these could be compatible with them. So it's not a who is better type of thing. It's just, uh, will they work together? Are they so similar that it would be fine in a project? So uh, by feel, they feel the same, but again, I'm going to wait until I get my Michael's order. I just really wanted to open this up. Uh, I've been waiting for this for a little bit and I was excited. See, this is how it was online. The flash of the bulb or whatever, when they took the picture is, uh, is bringing out those colors to be brighter than they are by the eye. And you can see that on camera as well. Same with this. This one really looks like the Michaels yarn. And then this is darker. So we'll see. We'll see. Uh, they did not have this color at my Michaels. They had this one. Uh, I tried to get one that was like, I think it was called blush something. And uh, they said it was in store, but it wasn't. And they had to refund me. So I will shoot the rest of this later when I get my Michaels yarn. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there. So I have my loops and threads yarn. This is the same specs as Kenyan Colors, 109 yards, 3.5 ounces, 100 meters, 100 grams. This is a bulky weight five as well, calls for an L11 8mm crochet hook and color is Rainy Day Multi, 100% acrylic. So I was right and wrong at the same time. Two things can be true at once, correct? So I was right in that this picture matches this yarn. Hence why I thought they were the same yarn. 
or so similar that it hurt. Uh, they're not. You can see the color difference here between Kenyan colors and loops and threads, uh, Charisma. There's a big difference there. There is way more uh, richness to the premier Kenyan colors. Also, the feel of Kenyan colors is just better. It just feels better. It's, I don't know. It's a bulky weight five, but it is more of a drapier yarn. Like if you made a cardigan out of it, this would be drapier on you than the loops and threads. The loops and threads has more of a squoosh factor to it, if you will. But uh, the Kenyan colors definitely feels like a more quality yarn. Like you can feel it in the yarn. I don't know what they do. Premier has me boggled. Um, they boggle my mind because their yarn is just like other yarns, except it feels miles better. <laughs> I don't understand. I don't get it. I don't know what they do to it, but they do something to it. Uh, it's not the same yarn. Could you use it together? Sure, sure, but it is noticeable. Uh, just keep that in mind. It is very similar, though. You could uh, do one of Loops and Threads, one of Premier Canyon Colors, and you'd have a beautiful project, without a doubt. It's like lighter tones of the Premier yarn. So uh, the other one that I compared it to when I was talking about the Canyon Colors is Serenity Chunky, which the Loops and Threads is more similar to Serenity Chunky. You could see squoosh wise it's a little more the same uh the bounce in the yarn however serenity chunky is even more loftier than the loops and threads again premiere i don't i don't know they they have some kind of voodoo that they use on their yarn that makes it just so good but this loops and threads yarn is it's a good yarn i like this yarn i buy this yarn i use it i have for a long time and like I said previously, this isn't what is the better yarn. Uh, it's just a matter of, I thought they matched. I did. I really did. So I was wrong. Um, I was right in that they did match because this matches this. But I was wrong in that the yarn itself does not match. So they tricked me. They did. Premier tricked me um, with their photo. But that's okay. That's fine. I don't mind having yarn, and I don't mind comparing them. I also am very excited to try this yarn out. So keep an eye out for that review, because I will be doing that. I will probably work up some sort of hat or cowl or something with it. Uh, I have one of each of the Autumn Sunset, Retro Sunset, sorry. Retro Sunset and Stormy Day. Storm Cloud. Okay, so this one's called Rainy Day. Yeah, Storm Cloud, Rainy Day. Easy to confuse. And Retro Sunset. So Retro Sunset and Storm Cloud, I will review the Canyon Colors yarn. I can tell you already like it. I, I love Premier Yarns. I don't think I've been disappointed with one of their yarns. No. Not in my recollection, I have never been disappointed with one of their yarns. So go premiere. You know what you're doing. Um, just a heads up on the yarn. I mean, that's pretty much all I have to say to it. Serenity isn't close enough to the loops and threads, but it's similar. You could combine these in a project as well. Like I said, this one's a little loftier and floofier. Um, composition, though, they all look like they are too twisted together. We already know about this one because I have used it. This one is a two-ply. Serenity we know is a two-ply. Kenyan colors, I will take the end out and check it out. Yeah, it just feels different. So they make yarn and then they place a magical spell over it and make it feel even better than any other yarn available. Yep, two-ply. Yeah, 
this just feels so much better than the loops and threads and that's not to say that loops and threads feels bad it's just premiere feels 10 times better so go check them out i am going to review this beautiful yarn soon take care until next time guys